Hey everyone, I'm getting ready to travel a bit this weekend, going to go see the wildflowers, which I look forward to every year. And I just wanted to share with you a little video on what I pack because a few of you have asked. So I switch back and forth between different bags. Let me show you. I have this smaller bag, which I use when I may be doing a little hike or I'm just going to a coffee shop or maybe the park. It's a little bit smaller, but when I'm going away for a full three days or a weekend, this is what I use. And I could probably narrow this down a little bit because I probably have too much. So this is a little bit bigger bag and huh, it's quite big, you guys. So let me just show you some of the things I have in there. Obviously, I carry my water on the outside. Um, I bring my My Lang paints because they are really easy to carry. They're somewhat small. And let me, let me move my bag here so it's a little bit easier to see. Okay, so I got a lot of goodies in here, guys, and... I stuff my bag, so I have to be a little bit um, mindful of what I'm bringing because there's only so much room. So these are just my essential oils. I bring those in there because I like my calming oils, my lavender that I will put on. I've got, let's see, let's go for the big things first. So I have my Artisto paper. I have always bring that pad with me. I have got... I have both of my um, paint palettes, but I may leave one of those home. This is actually the brand new Yulon series with 24 colors by Paul Rubens. So I'm not sure which one of those I'm gonna bring, kind of bulky bringing them both. I try to bring one. Um, I If I'm gonna be gone for several days, I like to also have my larger sheets of paper. So this is that Artisto, you know, I'm a, a fan of theirs. And let's see, a little redundant, I know, but I've got my tiny little Meaden block. And I like this one because it's small and I don't have to tape it down. So it's pretty easy to fit in. So I've got that as well. Um, I have my little tripod here. And that's just a little desk tripod that I've used quite frequently if I wanna tape something. So I have that. Let's see what else I have in here. That's just my swatch sheet from my, my Lang paints. I do have a few paper towels in here. Um, so this is something I recently started doing because I didn't want to end up with a broken palette. So I have these little foam sheets and here is one of my palettes and I just cover it like that just in case so it won't break. And this is a little bit smaller one than my normal palette. So it's a little bit easier to travel with, but I like sitting outside and having my pretty things. Okay, now for all the tiny fun stuff. And I am a huge fan of lots of little pouches. So tonight I will put a lot of these things kind of combined together in little pouches. So I have my smaller spray bottle to activate my paints. And I usually empty that out because I've had them spill in my bag. So I have my brushes, my craft little brushes that I'm so excited to share with you guys. So I have those, just got those, bringing those this weekend to play with. I have, and these are all little things that I would put in a pouch for sure. I have my kneaded eraser. Let's see what else I have in here. Um, I will switch this out and bring my Ohuhu uh, marker, fine liner. I've got, I also have this eraser, which is just, I really like it if I'm going to do a lot of erasing. It's that Mitsubishi and you can peel it off. Love that. It lasts forever. Um, I've got a couple of my MAB metallics because you know how I love those. So look at how much stuff I have, but yet... I keep it, try to keep it as small as possible. I always bring a binder clip because you know what? It's just useful for a lot of things. Um, I've got a pencil, my gosh. I've got a pencil in here. 
I tend to always bring my white gouache because I do like using it for certain things. So that is the Mission brand titanium white, which is my favorite white gouache. And then I just have a few more little cute clips I can put on my journal. I can use if I wanna hold down my paper. If I'm out painting, hiking, um, a lot of times it can get windy and those can be helpful. Almost done. Um, let's see, what else have I got in here? Uh, I like bringing my iPad. So that fits in here and it's, I, I try to find backpacks that have a little bit of padding to protect that. And then in the front, I keep, usually I just keep my personal things in there, like maybe lip gloss or chapstick, or um, I always carry a little atomizer with me to spray my face. Um, and then these are all my power cords. I keep that in there. This particular bag has a little um, cut in the front so I can put my plug through the front of it. And then there's those disposable paper towels. These are great. And when I'm out, I can even, you know, if I use them, I can just leave them out and they will dry. And I can, I just keep reusing them till I get back home. And my little, this is Faber-Castell. And this is the little um, water cup, which is really great. A lot of times too, in the past, I have brought with me the water um, pens and you just fill them up with water and then you use them. I don't have one right in here in front of me. Hold on, I might. Uh, but I think you guys know what those are. And I will you bring those a lot of times because they're pretty handy. And I think that's it. Sometimes I'll have some odds and ends. Oops, I have a few more little adapters in here. But that's it. That's what I bring with me. Um, I'll probably get my little journal book in there because I like and my personal book of adventures and I'll paint scenery I seen or, um, you know, palm trees, different things that I just see out there. So this is our view from one of our windows. We stayed in a little trailer and some of my desert scapes. This was 6-4 last year. This was March 23rd. A few more, just kind of plain. I like to try and capture. So that's kind of what I do. This is a nice little journal book. And if you have any questions about anything um, or you'd like a link to something, just ask. I don't know about this backpack, but I'm sure there's lots of them on Amazon you could get that are very similar. Um, I like them to be compact, carry my water, and I can pack with them or hike with them. All right, everybody, I hope you get out and paint outside and enjoy the wild bloom right now. I can't wait to go this weekend, and um, let me know if you have any questions. All right, bye, everybody.